Kurala Chibana, celebrity partner of the United Nations World Food Program, visited the disaster-stricken area in northern Japan on April 23rd, a little over a month after the Great East Japan earthquake. The town of Minami Sanniku in Miyagi Prefecture was devastated by the tsunami. Over 70% of the homes here were totally destroyed. Household items and personal mementos are buried under the rubble. The town's Utatsu Junior High School serves as an evacuation center. About 200 people are sheltered here. <laughs> On this day, WFP's high energy biscuits were distributed at the evacuation center. WFP delivered these in response to the request by Miyagi Prefecture. Each high-energy biscuit contains 40 kilocalories of energy and 14 vitamins and minerals. They are packed with nutrition. Found in a corner of town are one large tent installed by WFP and five prefabricated modules that can be used as offices. The tent and prefabricated offices were donated to the town by WFP. These are used in various ways to support the affected people. The tent provided by WFP is used as the base for the Disaster Response Volunteer Center. It's also used as a place for the volunteers to clean the mementos found among the rubble. こういうふうにあの、システムというか、この動きが固まってきたところだと思うんですが、大変ありがたい話で、本当はもっと一等二等三等が欲しいくらいなんですけれども、スペース的に駐車場もないですし、建てる場所もないので、あの、本当にこの
the aid group using the storage tents are developing an inventory control system for the relief supplies. Once this system is established, this place will become a full-scale logistics hub, ensuring more efficient assistance. WFP plans to erect 45 tents and 35 prefabricated offices in the affected areas. Other than as warehouses, these tents can be used for many purposes, among them a temporary area for shops. The United Nations World Food Program is the world's largest humanitarian agency fighting hunger worldwide. On any given day, WFP operates 60 aircrafts 40 ships, and 4,000 trucks around the world to deliver aid to those in need. As the lead logistics agency for the United Nations, WFP has decades of experience in delivering food and other relief items in challenging environments. This is the warehouse of a logistics company in Chiba Prefecture. Food and beverages donated by over 20 companies as relief supplies have been gathered here. The delivery of these supplies to the affected regions is also part of WFP's operations. Japan Association for WFP, an official WFP supporting organization, collects the food and beverages from donor companies. These supplies are first gathered at the warehouse. WFP then transports these supplies to the warehouses in the affected areas. These are then delivered to the affected people through the municipalities and NGOs. On this day, instant noodles and vegetable juice provided by donor companies were delivered from the warehouse in Chiba Prefecture to Ishinomaki City in Miyagi Prefecture. Shortly after the supplies arrived at the Ishinomaki warehouse, they were loaded onto trucks and transported to the evacuation centers. In response to the request from the Japanese government, WFP is also transporting some of the relief items from other countries and international agencies, such as blankets and water, to the afflicted areas. WFP is also giving support to non-governmental organizations. Four experienced WFP staff members have been loaned to Japan Platform, a humanitarian consortium made up of over 30 NGOs. The loan staff support the relief activities of the NGOs by providing them with skills and expertise. <laughs> <laughs> At night in a hotel in Sendai City, WFP staff members are holding a meeting after returning from the field. 24 WFP staff members, including 14 Japanese, have been called to Japan from around the world to conduct operations. So, like, you know, we started, there's one in here, uh -huh. and then uh, Minami Sandiku. I w really wanted to be useful. I, I wanted to um, work for it, I wanted to make it happen, um, particularly this uh, type of uh, temporary storage facilities, you know, this uh, mobile storage unit that we have. Um, it is very effective in this kind of uh, temporary setting, emergencies and quick uh, setup. So I thought it really is a useful item. You know, and you think to yourself, you know, how can you help to, you know, how, how can you participate in this? And um, coincidentally, you know, they, uh, said I can go and I can go help and you know participating in building these these weak holes you know and for me it was a great ex great experience and you know I, after you know going to Ishinomaki and watching the towns how they are it you know inspires you to you know try harder and work more and uh, but it's uh, been a, an excellent experience you know I think a life-changing experience we have to do something we that not mean only WFP not only mean Japanese 
all the people in, uh, in the world have to do something for this disaster. That feeling is still continuous, and actually it's growing more and more. Work to construct the tent in Minami Sanniku was conducted in the falling rain. In addition to eight volunteers, four local people who were affected by the disaster also took part in the construction. They worked until late afternoon in the pouring rain. もう、あの、見ただけでも、ちょっと震えるとかもう感動しました。本当にありがとう。はい。本当にありがとう。と思う。でもよくこの雨中やりますって来て、さっき佐々木さんと朝に電話したんだけど、よくやってくれた。これだ